What's up guys, Chris from Eagle Ridge Homestead. So I wanted to share a quick update before I get into the next video. Um, I want to thank so many people that I've been keeping track that have commented and subscribed. Um, I went from like 79 to 94. That's, that's fantastic. And I tell you what, I wanted to sweeten the giveaway. And I've not told Lazy Pond Farm or Cooper Family yet. But if by sunday's live video and in a couple days i'm going to be putting up a reminder for everybody if by sunday i have 150 subscribers i'm going to add a third gift to the giveaway and it's super secret i'm not going to tell you what it is okay but if we hit 150 by sunday i'm going to add that in there yes i do still have the flu and a little case of pneumonia so but i'm okay got antibiotics and and some other meds try to get this cleared out anyway so i hope you guys enjoy the following video these were recorded before i really got terribly ill so but yeah if we can get 150 by sunday which would be uh seven days from march 22nd i don't know the date right off i'm going to add a third prize and it is super secret and you have to stay tuned to see what it is so all right guys thank you so much and please enjoy the following video thank you again to lazy pond farm and to cooper family homestead for helping me out with this giveaway this is our first giveaway our first live stream this is our first collaborative video that's so amazing and the community outreach has been amazing as well thank you guys and it's going to be a good day i just wanted to show you guys my azalea right quick i'm really proud of that it took a long time to get it like that so i think it's pretty cool what's up guys chris from eagle ridge so i still don't feel good but seeds don't wait and these are going to be my my late season starts um most of what i'm going to have will be direct sow into the ground so these are going to be some that I go ahead and just have starting up. So, it's also a good time to show you one of my other recycling projects. And yes, I'm wearing gloves because I don't want to get up and go in the house and wash my hands and get up and go in the house and wash my hands. I'm not doing all that today. So I also like to use egg cartons. So, this holds 18 this particular one I've got another one that's just a standard dozen but I do it one of two ways that sometimes I will take them and split them and just have this little group of four this little group of four this little group of four on this one I don't I haven't decided yet I don't think I'm gonna split that up I'm just gonna go ahead and start all 18 of them and leave the lid so that for right now at least I can cover them up kind of incubate them so let's talk about that <laughs> hope everybody is doing well I'm glad you got to see me again all right so just picked up some cheap American seed potting mix it is seed starting potting mix but it's just potting mix throw that in there and then we'll spread it out I usually have an apron on too when I do this and I just did not feel like getting back up and going in there and getting it so. and then push it like that whatever's left over comes back here I can easily put it right back in there all right this next step I've heard conflicting things obviously with the uh, the peat pots you wet those down because they have to expand this you don't but I've also heard that you're supposed to I don't know this is actually some of the first 
of me doing seeds. I usually just directly sow into the ground. So I'm going to let that get watered up. That sit, work its magic. We're gonna move down this little guy. So, what's on everybody's minds? Hope everybody's doing well. This is also why I've not done a seeding video yet because I feel like I'm just boring you guys. But also, I know if I do this wrong, one of you will let me know. At least one of you. Maybe more. I don't know. If it gets on the bench, it gets on the bench. No biggie. No biggies. We'd like to have used our own compost this year. But this guy, I forgot to put a screen. I use an old bathtub for my compost. And I forgot to put a screen over the drain so I'd quit losing dirt. So, that one was on me. So, again, please, if I'm doing this wrong, tell me. So I'll know next time. Because it just doesn't seem to be, like, soaking up the water at all this one see like I don't understand that I might just have to cancel this whole video until I figure this out so I don't know what am I doing wrong guys <laughs> <All right. coughs> well there we go I guess we'll move on to something else. <laughs> Since seating wasn't going very well, I figured I'd move on to out here. So, I'm going to cut some uh, landscape fabric to put into each tray, and then we'll fill it with dirt. Awesome. Let's see now. Oh, it's coming down. Exactly what I want. Take my seeds and start them. <laughs> 